hello this is Harry you know who I am and I'm here to make my videos to continue to pick up from where I left off and of course I'm going to be continuing making these videos pointing out the abuse that I receive every day electronically on the computer on uh, through my internet and through my inbox gmail account and we all know who the suspicious offender is overseas, Mika Ajala from Europe, and so of course his abusive behavior to create malice and to cause trouble just to get back at me because he has nothing else better to do to stalk women online and harass them because he is a low shame piece of shit asshole guy that is so insecure of himself and is a disruptive mess and cannot control himself in compulsive behavior and act impulsive towards women online who refuse and disrespects women on their requests on being left the fuck alone so anyway we all know that story from the beginning and as I continue but I'm going to bring out um, the emails that uh, I wanted to bring out to the attention to of course this guy always fucking tries to fucking interfere with me so of course this who um, in its legitimacy who would send something like this to my email so of course we always know it's suspicious and we know who it's coming from and we know it's originating from Europe so there's just a bunch of random letters and numbers and so we went to go check out the original and we copied the header to it and so we go to our message analyzer and we're gonna paste that there analyze the header above show the raw header copy it and of course this guy um, is very dirty in working with email because he will bombard the email header with uh, suspicious messages and letters and numbers that are random that doesn't make sense but always portrays and saying or stating out words to portray a suspicious message and of course we know it's coming from Europe and I'm gonna show that what I'm showing the example of so this is good evidence for the cops when I do report uh, all of this illegal activity online so there you go um, there are the Europeans that had stated in the suspicious message and of course we know Mika is from Europe so that's the good keyword um, he wants to keep playing all these little um, bullshit games online to sus send me suspicious messages that doesn't make sense or try to portray a message to get across my um, messages and look all of this right here is just random words uh, maybe portraying to a suspicious message but anyway I do not read this I do not pay attention to this but I just wanted to point out and bring the attention to so there it is again and we know it's coming from Europe so that's the keyword right there and what we do is that we copy all of this and we save it onto a document and we print out the hard copy of the full email header and so uh, we are going to show this printed material and pinpoint that it's coming from Europe and that is the bright shiner to show the evidence against the uh, offender who is coming from Europe and you want to play these little uh, obvious games that it is coming from Europe and so that is the good evidence that we could use against Mika Ajala.
that lives in Manta. On this part of the video, I'm always gonna always pinpoint and bring out the attention to where this uh, uh, various attacks are happening. And I have reported these links. And so like this guy just really, something really psychologically wrong with him in his head where he thinks he could just uh, punish me with excessive messages arriving in my inbox and so I don't know what this guy thinks or the fuck who this guy who the fuck he thinks he is where he thinks he could just abuse someone online on the side and thinking that he does this just to create trouble to stand along my way but he seriously needs to get the fuck over himself because obviously he's got some fucking psychological problems with himself sending these numerous emails you know what I'm always talking about but I'm just gonna pinpoint and make this video and bring to the attention of and showing you evidence and examples of what I am talking about in this fucking video already it seems like it never fucking ends dude seriously fucking uh, this guy's very impulsive towards women his behavior is very every fucking single day this is bullshit it's fucking games so obviously I mean if you're gonna go against somebody's fucking free will and send bullshit to their inbox it's gonna add up and accumulate over the days and everything that you send I send to reporting links and of course they have your information and about the messages entailing being sent to my inbox and I'm just gonna show you this guy is a fucking borderline sociopath that has no fucking meaning and it is fucking so look I'm gonna show you and to the girl that who is dating Mika Ajala I want to show this to you one after another an attack so I'm just letting you know that this guy is trying to womanize me on the side while he is in a relationship with you and obviously some this fucking psychopath has something on the side while he is having sex with another woman and tries to fucking in interfere with my email two hours ago for 6 p.m. one after another so I just wanted to show you that this fucking asshole has nothing else better to do to fucking invade me. There's your male enhancement products again. One after another. Facebook phishing messages. And more in male enhancement products. Which I would castrate this fucking asshole fucking shove it down his fucking throat and look at these little fucking direct size suspicious messages you fucking make no sense dude and I do not fucking pay attention to your bullshit so the star and the arrow means that I had did a full report sending through ic3.gov reporting gmail abuse looking for the host who these abusive emails are coming from forwarding these emails to abuse at the host and so all these little reports are going to accumulate and also to uh, file a police report with Europol European police and also make complaints against your fo Facebook profiles so there you go you've been fucking asking for it and it's going to be thrown back at your face so whatever you fucking send me, I send back to you as the fucking karmatic energetic fields will fucking destroy you 
and your fucking peace of mind, which obviously you are disturbed because I fucking brainwashed you. And you can't get over. So another part of the video is just to explain more fucking emails I am getting. Look at this fucking retarded asshole. Why do you fucking send me telling me to stop sending me your naked photos? What the fuck are you talking about? I never fucking sent you any naked photos. And obviously you fucking make up some little fucking lie in your head to fucking make up bullshit to send my way. Seriously, dude, you're fucking retarded. One after another. Look, girl, the girl that who's dating me, God, look at all this bullshit that I have to endure because he sends this bullshit to me every fucking single day. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. All of these are going to be fucking reported. What do you get back tonight? Please reply me. I love you. What a fucking lie, dude. You never fucking loved me. You don't know what the fuck love is about me. Fucking some little fucking fairy tale in your fucking head. Facebook phishing messages. Fucking direct suspicious. Living in Europe, of course. Thank you for the evidence that this guy, Mika Jala, is from fucking Europe. And I save all these little messages and highlight them and show it to the fucking cops. This right here is probably saying, do you want to have sex with me? You fucking asshole. Look at, all, look at all this fucking bullshit making up all this fucking little fucking internet fucking email games, more in mail enhancement products. Look at all of this. Read this. Good morning. How are you? I'm writing this message. I hope you're interested to read it. I am Antonia. I'm very nice to meet you. To create a family, I'll tell you more about myself. If you write me back, if you're interested, I'm glad to know each other. I send you more of my photos, response at fucking whatever email address that you made up. And you want to fucking be on the side with another fucking chick fucking playing your games behind your back. Seriously, this guy is fucking retarded. He's drunk. Nobody fucking likes him. His band fucking sucks. He's a complete fucking drunk mess. Obviously, nobody fucking likes you, but you know what? You want to go on your way to fucking abuse women online when obviously the real people in your country do not fucking like you and you make excuses to fucking... Um, interfere with women in different countries and you like to pick on women but if a man picks on you you're fucking scared and terrified to fucking fight him cause you know you're gonna fucking get your ass fucked up fucking beaten up fucking your ass kicked and you fucking don't mess around with men because they will fuck you up but then you go on your other way to pick on women but you think that I am defenseless little do you not know Mika I am very, very strong in what I do. And this woman you cannot control. So I'm just letting you know that I always fucking fight back. I would never let anybody take advantage of me. Look. All this fucking, fucking kank, crank, wankering, fucking canker horse slut. Seriously, dude, you're not fucking right in the head. Look at all of this sent to the girl that you are dating on the side and you want to send your bullshit thinking that you're innocent and you just want to use some other girl for sex, but then you'll go on your other way to fucking perform malice towards other women, which... You say that took advantage of you just because we refuse to have sex with you and you fucking have no other desperate way to get back at me. So this is how you get back at me. Obviously, you're fucking breaking the law, dude. And uh, yes, it is very illegal and you are breaking the law because uh, sextortion is 
for land you in prison and exploitation on the internet is obviously a sexual offense. Okay, so I'm just making this last part of the video. I just wanted to tell you um, that I just wanted to say that uh, I hate the type of men that thinking that since they are the man and that they automatically have the seat to say what and to women on the man's request. I hate them type of men thinking that they can control women just because they have the stronger or the alpha of the male versus the female. Uh, I hate the type of men thinking that they could just say and abuse women just because they feel like the man has the power over a woman. I hate the type of men thinking that they could just interfere with women and thinking that they can get away with it. But little did these men know that I do not let these type of people interfere with me, tell me what to do, try to control me, uh, because I am stronger than that and I had made myself saying that nobody else in this world can control me, especially a man. And uh, them type of men are weak because they have obviously something wrong in their head uh, just because they consider the male as alpha, which can be opposite of including this alpha. A female has her capability to make alpha in her life if she feels like it and refuses men to let her try to control herself in any way and I am opposite from letting anybody, any person, any woman, any man try to control me and tell me what to do and you are very mistaken if you have that mindset thinking that the male alpha has every control and every what say so in a relationship which is very opposite and very obscure st staying that the man has power over women which is very falsely mistaken and you gotta learn to deal with that and you gotta learn to accept that and you gotta learn to respect that just because some other person wants to control another person which has the capability to deny that and letting that happen to let anybody else control you and that is the reason why I say this because I will never let any person on this world try to control me and tell me what the fuck to do because I am my own person I have my own freedom I have my own free wills and I have my own saying on what how I want to control my life in a way where I have nobody else interfering because I make my own decisions and so be it.